today, we're gonna be grading the 2024 Euros national team jerseys. Starting with Albania. It's unclear if the Balkan nation will be provided with a new kit for this Euros. This is their 2023-24 jerseys and they are simple. It have a little graphic on the front but is not something that pops. It looks good, the colors pop and I think this is a solid 4 out of 10. Austria. Puma released the red and white kits. The red one with a round collar, and it has a design on the front that represents the architecture in their country, and the white kit has some sparks of peppermint type of color. I like the fact that the red is a fire red and it pops. The white kit is a little more bland. I will give this a 5 out of 10. Belgium. This is just beautiful. Both of these jerseys look so good because of the gold accents. This time, they used the burgundy instead of the bright and fire red they are used to, but still, this is just beautiful. And the away kit, that light blue is so good with the white and the gold but the shorts I just don't like them. This uniform pays tribute to Tintin, but because of that color combination, I'm gonna give it a 8 out of 10. Croatia. I'm so disappointed in Nike, because what is this? How could you fumble one of the most recognizable and iconic jersey designs? This is just so bad. It looks like they didn't even try, they just printed some big red squares and that's it. And the blue one is kind of a little better I guess, but still, this is not it. I'm giving this a 5 out of 10. Looks like a training kit. Czech Republic. This jerseys are really simple, but the blue accents on the red one gives it a touch. Makes the jersey pops and the whole uniform is a great color combo. On the white one it kind of doesn't pops but I think it looks good, you know, simple but nice, it's alright. I'm gonna give it a 5.5 out of 10, Denmark. They are really consistent with their color scheme, always red for the home kit, and white for the away kit. This time they did a polo type of jersey for the away kit, and both of them have this texture design on the jersey to give it a little something. It's just a solid jersey and I'm gonna give it a 5 out of 10. England. These are some clean jerseys. For the home kits they did a fake V polo collar and added a dark blue stripe down the sides. For the away kit they used a dark pale maroon, something different from their traditional dark blue. They added gold accents and used a multicolor side panel. Overall, this is a really nice jersey and I'm giving it a 7.5 out of 10. France. These jerseys right here are so fire. They bring out some memories. They went back to the bright blue with the tricolor collar, the big and gold crest. I like everything on this one. The white one with the pinstripes design that go from left to right in blue and red. My god, this is how good jerseys are supposed to look. But they overdid it with the pinstripes on the shorts. They should have just left them in blue. So for that I'm giving it a 9.5 out of 10. Georgia. Just like Albania, it seems pretty unlikely that they will have a brand new kit for the Euros. This is their 2023 kit, and it probably has a sentimental value for them now, because they made history with them. They are pretty simplistic jerseys, and I'm giving it a 4 out of 10. Germany. These jerseys are so so good. It feels like nostalgia. They feature the German flag on the shoulder panels with this gradient effect. They are inspired on the 1994 World Cup jerseys. The away kit. They went with a really different color scheme for this one. Being inspired by the bold colors of the 1990 kits. The pink and purple gradient is done really well, although, it feels weird seeing Germany with those colors. Overall, they look really great. I'm giving it a perfect 10. Hungary. These jerseys are really nice. I actually like the color scheme, the little pops of green and how everything flows really good together. I personally like the white one more, it's just too clean, especially with the shorts. That little design on the side that matched the jersey with the short it's perfect. I'm giving these a 6 out of 10. Italy. These are one of my favorite jerseys. I know they probably are a little simple but, the attention to detail and the position of every color is perfect. How they did the three stripes down the shoulders panels with the colors of the flag, the dark blue on the back with the white stripe on the side. But the white kit is just so beautiful. How they have the flag represented from left to right, 
with the green on the left, the blue on the center, and the red on the right, perfection. I'm giving this a 10 out of 10. There you have it, this is part 1. Part 2 will be out tomorrow. Like and subscribe. Comment your favorite one out of all of these.